The Happy Peanut by Bryce Vincent Pemble. It helps to know that nitrogen is what I like to call a peanut molecule. It's a diatomic molecule shaped roughly like the legume. The Happy Peanut. Once there was a tiny peanut named Jenny. She would happily bounce around playing all day with her pal named Ox in the clear blue sky. One day, a kaiju monster, a human, lumbered by, trying to absorb Jenny to help him grow even bigger. Jenny simply laughed and said, you can't fix me. The great beast breathed her into his lungs, but Jenny was right. He could not fix her. When he exhaled, she came back out completely unharmed. So it was. She was out of the reach of all of the animals that dwell on the earth. So Jenny went on playing carefree in the blue sky with Ox. They also tried to get Argy to play with them, but no such luck. The next day, she passed by a giant redwood tree, the tallest plant in the world. She was trying to avoid the plants, but this one stretched so far into the sky. The towering tree also tried to absorb Jenny to help it grow even mightier. Jenny simply laughed and said, you can't fix me. The tall tree breathed her into its leaves, but Jenny was right. It could not fix her. She came back out completely unchanged. So it was, she was out of the reach of all of the plants that grow on the earth. So Jenny went right on playing happily with Ox in the blue sky. On the third day, she found a tiny bacterium on the top of a mountain. It also tried to absorb Jenny to help him grow at least slightly bigger. Jenny just giggled and said, seriously, you can't fix me. The microscopic creature breathed her into its cell. But Jenny was surprised because it actually could fix her. After that day, Jenny made a point of avoiding all nitrogen-fixing bacteria. The end. There may be a sequel, guys, about how she breaks out, how she explodes out but I haven't gotten that far. So I hope you enjoyed my little children's story about the element nitrogen. Brought to you by Mr. Pemble, cartographer.